Hi, I'm Susan Hollenberger. I'm from Aurora, Colorado, and I'm here at Presbyterian St. Luke's. I have been menopausal for probably four years, and I noticed some uh, intermittent bleeding, so I came in to see Dr. Faust, who did an exam and determined that I had fibroid tumors that needed to be addressed, and he referred me to Dr. DeBella. Okay, so I went and made an appointment with Dr. DeBella and came in to see him regarding the issue because I knew intermittent bleeding was not appropriate at my age and stage of my life. And so he um, did an exam and found that there were fibroid tumors that needed to be removed. And so uh, we discussed surgery. So we determined based on the ultrasound and the physical exam that there were a couple of fibroids and the best approach was to have a hysterectomy. And we discussed the options and we decided that the best approach would be to have a robotic hysterectomy. Uh, surgery went very well and recovery went well. Um, uh, and Susan went home first day after the surgery. So while I was in the hospital, I was treated very well by the staff. They made sure I got up and was walking because we don't want to have pulmonary embolisms in your legs or swelling in your feet. Um, and so I was up and walking around and they were very helpful. They were there to assist me when I needed to. And um, I felt the staff did a really well, well job in, in keeping me safe and sound in the hospital. This is one of the main advantages of using robotic uh, uh, laparoscopic uh, approach for hysterectomies because recovery is easy and fast and there is less trauma to the tissue and that's why the patients recover very well uh, without the need for lots of narcotics and uh, prolonged hospitalization. In pre-op where they get you ready for surgery and I was um, told that I would be testing out the new blanket and they reminded me of the blankets that the firemen use when they have when the hot shotters are after um, those big fires in the in the mountains um, so I thought wow that's pretty cool and it actually did keep me very very warm so I was very surprised that the piece of uh, looked like tin foil um, would keep you nice and warm um, what I would say to anyone who has questions about a hysterectomy, um, just ans ask all the questions that you need to in order to feel comfortable about making the right decision. Um, and Dr. DeBella and his staff really are here for you, and they're not going to force you into anything you don't want to, want to do. They're going to make sure you understand the whole process and, and what's going to happen and how it's going to happen. And, what may happen and what may not happen and just rest assured that not everything happens to everyone.